WFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman on this 20, uh, 19th day of January and this is the 10 a.m. Tiger Financial News Network update and we're looking at the market with the Dow up 137 at uh, 35,500 after yesterday's really bad red candle underneath all the support levels. This is a bounce, as I said to my subscribers to my opening call. Uh, we remain short the Dow and see what happens after this. We're looking at the S&P <clears throat> up 29 at 4606. It's holding. It's gone under, but now it's holding. The Chapman Wave inside track. It should be the propellant zone. It went underneath it. Let's see if it's able to get to 46.22 uh, over the next two days. That's going to be important because a new low uh, would be uh, very negative, especially on the weekly chart. We're looking at the QQQ. So the S&P is up 0.71%. The Dow is up 0.44%. And the Qs are up 1%. That's good. Up 362 at 374. <clears throat> uh, we're looking at also an inside bar so far. Yesterday, this is very interesting, the Dow and the S&P and the IWM both broke the left side lows. The um, QQQ NDX 100 did not. That's a good sign. But the weekly chart has gone outside below the uh, inside track propellant zone. Now it's a repellent zone. We're going to be watching this very closely. All I can say is a move below 367 in the next few days would be very negative. We're looking at the IWM, the Russell 2000, <coughs> excuse me, uh, up 29 cents at 208.16. It's taking out all the left side lows. It's made uh, a low yesterday in the 207s. This, right now it's a 208. <coughs> Not a good chart pattern in the rectangle formation. Talking about the rectangle formation, what we were talking about on my show is that the dollar should go out of the rectangle formation below 95.52 and then come to revisit it back into the 95.60.70 area and then go back out under it and it's at 95.58. We're going to be watching this closely. Why? Because gold is a good opportunity here to move sharply higher. It's up 15 at 18.27. If gold gets to the 1835 area, that's going to be a good sign. And the TLT we'll talk about in my show coming up. The Tiger Technicians Hour just way down with yields going up. I'll be back for the Tiger Technicians Hour in a moment and check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. See you soon. Hope you can stay. Thank you.